So at the Trust, our mission statement and really what we want to be is that expert supporter who will help young people and those who look after them, be them teachers or carers, as the young person moves from school through into further education and then on into the workplace. We want to be that trusted friend who can put an arm around you when you need help and give you expert advice. So we're always there. For, for a charity uh, like us, we are completely reliant on the generosity of our supporters. And therefore, any initiative that helps our supporters help us is fantastic. And the Big Give that is, is the most wonderful uh, idea and a wonderful opportunity for us because between the 29th of November and the 6th of December any donation that anybody generously gives to the Trust gets doubled. So it is a wonderful opportunity for us in the lead up to Christmas to make sure we can carry on doing what we need to do and what we desperately want to do. If we could arm people with the right tools to deal with episodes when they happen to themselves or to others, that is a, a you know that that is their primary mission. There's no magic bullet that solves all mental health issues, but each individual will have a way out of that darkness. And the trust plan and always has been is to educate people, to give them the tools to to make that step towards the light. So as a parent, it's been really affirming, I think, and reassuring to know that Charlie Waller is in partnership with Fitzmaurice School. Um, I know from my own child, but also from many of the parents that I meet at the school gate, there's a lot going on for children in general, and it's all been amplified now by COVID, what's happened in the last few years, and there's so much uncertainty in the world. When you see resilient children and parents, that ripples out because you often find that parents such as myself also look after their parents. And so by a parent having also had the skills for their own mental health, it allows us to be present, not just for ourselves and our children, but our parents and our families and our friends. For the school to be so involved and so active and proactive is a great thing as a parent. So yeah, really reassuring and I find it very forward thinking. When my son became ill with anorexia 20 years ago, I was working as a city stockbroker. And after he got better, I was so fascinated. We'd learned so much that I retrained with the team at the Maudsley Hospital. And then, you know, I'd been working in schools. And then about seven years ago, I was introduced to the Charlie Waller Trust. Lots of um, parents sadly learn very quickly. There's a very steep learning curve about mental health because suddenly their youngster is struggling with mental health. And then they learn very quickly. And thank goodness we at the Charlie Waller Trust can support them with that learning journey. I mean, it's such an amazing organization to be part of. It's a relatively small charity with the biggest heart. We engaged further with Charlie Waller Trust because of the depth with which we knew they could impact on the staff and our children and our parents. We saw something in their training and their delivery that would have a real impact on the well-being and mental health of all of our community. Every time we ask our children and our parents, do you, how do you feel about the mental health and well-being of your children? 100% of our parents and 100% of our children come back and say they feel well supported, feel safe, feel confident that they have an adult that they can go to. It's just been second to none. So my role is to go into schools and support teachers, parents and children with mental health and well-being. Schools can't afford to pay trainers. You know, it's, it's really, really expensive. There's no money out there for schools, really. So the fact that we're able to go in and offer this training for free is incredible. And the fact that it's proven, it's evidence-based, we're trained. You know, a lot of our staff are clinical, they've had lived experience, or they work in schools. They're getting such an amazing opportunity to, to change the way we teach, to change the way we communicate, to change the way we understand mental health. People should give to the Charlie Waller Trust because it has an impact and it makes a real difference to children up and down the land. It is something with a tangible response and a tangible impact and something that children will recognise for years to come. Something that has an impact now, but will also have an impact in 10 years time. I just think if you can support, then please do because mental health is essential. We cannot flourish without healthy mental health. And this charity works so hard so so hard to support people so if you, 
And the fact that they're able to do it for free is just incredible. So if we can support the charity to keep doing what we're doing, I think we can make huge changes. I suppose it's, it's really difficult, but the big Christmas give, 29th to the 6th of December, people are feeling the pinch, but the Charlie Waller Trust is doing phenomenal work in the field of mental health. So if you can put in a penny, it will be doubled. And think of all the amazing work that could do for people who will be struggling and, and the way that we can get that information out there so people can live happier and better and more fulfilled lives. We do need everybody's support and we do need everybody uh, to help us. And I'm absolutely confident that we will be able to carry on delivering what we do and carry on making a real difference.